Hey guys, it's Nelson with Galaxy Note 2 Softmodder, and today I'm going to show you Samsung's new music streaming service. It's called Milk Music. It's a strange name, and currently it's only available for Samsung users. So you can find it in the Play Store. Here it is. It's called Milk Music. Um, <clears throat> you can open it up, and uh, you can just agree to the terms. Um, this is a free music player, like I said, free music streaming service. Uh, something different about it uh, that sets it apart from something like Pandora or uh, Spotify's free versions that there are no ads on here. So now I'm going to skip through this and I'm going to show you guys um, a little bit of the application. Whoa. So uh, if we head over here, you can create a station. So I can type in Kid Cudi and um, as soon as I press that, it'll make a uh, it'll make a station for any of the songs. Um, you have six skips for each station. If you change the station, uh, you'll get another six skips, and it's per hour, so that starts over after the hour. Um, it, since it's a relatively new uh, station, it's also um, you won't have a lot of obscure, like very very obscure bands. So just test it out and I can uh, create station. Uh, the next thing is if we head back, whoa, uh, you'll see this dial here. Here you can see it says pop, hip hop, rock, country, R&B, alternative indie. Uh, these are different um, stations that you can uh, tap on. And if you tap different songs will play and you'll see um, it's you can go like this and you can control it like that. And it'll be new songs, old songs. Uh, you can skip these as long as, as much as you want. I don't know how often they change. Uh, but they're just different songs that you can uh, that you can listen to. Uh, if you go to manage my state, no, if you go to customize dial, actually, here you can uh, select which ones you want to show on the genres on the tuning dial. That's what that thing's called. Um, and you can only have nine at a time. Um, other settings that you can change. If you head over here to settings, you can change the auto audio quality to high. Uh, you can allow location, um, and you can also allow explicit content. Um, when you listen to songs, you can go here and press uh, to favorite, which you can then view here. And from there, you can, uh, I don't have any favorites currently, but if you have any, you can um, select them to start a new station. Uh, you can also choose to never play a song in a station, to remove the station that you're currently playing, or to create a station from the song directly from here. If you edit a station, uh, whoa, I can't edit the station, but... If I edit a station that I've created, which I'll here go here, uh, you can add other stations. You can add station seeds, which is to add another artist that's kind of similar to what um, to what you currently have. So I have Kid Cudi. Uh, I can use Kanye West, and it'll use both artists instead of just Kid Cudi to make a personalized uh, station. And yeah, all right. Well, that's it. Those are all the big features. Um, you can also whoa, actually. Let me show you one last one. Here you can fine tune uh, your station, um, choose more popular songs or less popular songs, choose more new songs, uh, and some of your favorites. And uh, that's just to fine tune all of the, uh, the stations that you create on here. So now that's it. Uh, it's a cool application. It's new. Like I said, it doesn't have that much song or that many songs as much as other ones, but it'll slowly build up. And it's currently only available for Samsung users. So if you got a Samsung Galaxy Note 3, S4, whatever. You can download it for free and check it out. Alright, well thanks guys. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and check out the full tutorial over at Galaxy Note 2 Softmodder. Alright, thanks.